Did you know that the average pet owner spends over $500 a year on toys alone? That's right, $500. But here's the thing. Your pet doesn't need pricey toys to have fun. In fact, some of the best toys can be made right at home with things you probably already have lying around. Let's talk about how easy and fun it is to make your own DIY pet toys. Welcome to today's video. We're diving into the world of homemade pet toys. Creative, affordable, and most importantly, your pets are going to love them. Why spend a fortune when you can create something unique and fun with your own two hands? Plus, there's nothing more satisfying than seeing your furry friend enjoy something you made just for them. We all know the frustration of buying an expensive toy, only to have our pets lose interest in it within days, sometimes even hours. And those toys that we hoped would last for months? Torn to shreds in minutes. The good news? You don't have to keep breaking the bank to keep your pets entertained. In fact, making your own pet toys can be a fun project for the whole family. It's a great way to involve kids in a creative activity and teach them the value of recycling and reusing materials. Let's start with some simple ideas, and I'll also share a couple of more advanced projects for those of you who are feeling particularly crafty. First up, the classic sock ball. For the sock ball, all you need is an old sock and a tennis ball. Simply put the ball inside the sock, tie a knot at the end, and you've got yourself a fun, chew-resistant toy that your dog will love to toss around. What's great about this toy is that you can customize it by adding more balls or even a squeaker if your dog loves that extra bit of noise. Next, we've got a simple toy that's perfect for cats, the cardboard tube puzzle. Take an empty toilet paper roll, make a few small holes in it and fill it with your cat's favorite treats. As your cat bats it around, the treats will slowly fall out, keeping them entertained and rewarding their curiosity. You can even paint the tube or cover it in colorful paper to make it more visually appealing. Just make sure to use non-toxic materials. Now, for the dog lovers out there, try making a braided rope toy. You'll need some old t-shirts or fabric scraps. Cut them into strips, braid them together tightly, and tie the ends into knots. It's durable, perfect for tug of war, and the fabric feels great on their gums. If you want to get fancy, you can mix different colors, or even add some beads to the ends for extra fun. Just make sure they're securely attached and safe for chewing. Here's one of my personal favorites, a crinkle toy for cats. Take an empty chip bag, clean it out and wrap it in fabric. Sew or tie the ends securely and you've got a crinkly crunchy toy that cats go crazy for. The sound is irresistible to most cats and the fabric gives them something to sink their claws into. You can also experiment with different types of fabric to see what your cat prefers. And now for something a little unexpected, a DIY treat dispenser. Grab a small plastic bottle, cut a few holes in the sides, just big enough for treats to fall out and fill it up with kibble or treats. Your dog will love the challenge of rolling the bottle around to get the treats out. It's a great way to keep them mentally stimulated and physically active. If your dog is a heavy chewer, you might want to use a thicker plastic bottle or reinforce the holes with tape. But wait, we're not done yet. Let's talk about a super easy DIY toy that will keep both cats and dogs entertained. A simple pom-pom toy. All you need is some yarn, scissors, and a bit of cardboard. Wrap the yarn around the cardboard several times, slide it off and tie it in the middle. Then cut the loops on both ends and fluff it up. Voila! You've got a fluffy, colorful toy that's perfect for batting around or chasing. Cats, in particular, seem to love the texture and movement of the yarn. If you're looking for something a bit more challenging, how about making a snuffle mat? This is a great project for those who want to give their dogs a bit of mental exercise. You'll need a rubber mat with holes, like the kind used for dish drying, and some fleece strips. Tie the fleece strips through the holes until the mat is completely covered then sprinkle some treats into the folds. Your dog will have a blast sniffing out the treats hidden in the mat. So there you have it, a variety of homemade pet toys that are simple to make, budget-friendly, and tailored to your pet's needs. Not only are these toys great for your pets, but they're also a fantastic way to recycle household items and get creative. Plus, making toys at home allows you to customize them based on your pet's preferences and play style. Now it's your turn. Have you ever made a toy for your pet? Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear your ideas. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more creative pet related content. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.